don't want any interference in the judiciary. We want to submit our petition and want the judiciary to do their work and let the winner, actual winner of the September 25th election of Edo State, you know, be declared the winner. So that's what we want. Thank you. Thank you. We are we brought out yesterday one person signed for agents. Yeah. One person signed all the spot yes. where all the other parties are supposed to sign. Is it on IRF? They made a blunder. They did all these things without thinking, without reasoning. And that is why we know that we have what it takes. Pastor, let me ask you. Okay, okay, please. Let me ask you. Dr. Abbey. I apologize, sir. I can ask a street question. We understand how election is done. And I don't know if the Honorable Commissioner can come yet and answer my question, sir. We understand the level of election, corruption in Nigeria, how they perpetuate this thing. And we're talking about an independent government. How was this election managed to be stolen under him? Oh, well, that is why we are here protesting because we did everything. We campaigned to our people. We, you know, sold our mandate to our people, go to the local Doing government, right thing. And the state and national level. And then, you know, and even in diaspora. But we were surprised that on that day, they were able to man uh, manipulate the results and read a different result from what, uh, you know, what's still in that. Uh, well, you were not ready to go dirty. No, that's there's right. no point. There's no need to go dirty. Election is not, election is not, not, not meant to be war. Campaign to the people, convince the people, let them come at an election day and vote. Then you go let the results and count. That is exactly what we did. Yes, yes, sir. So please, can you please so, the volume? Can you just speak as So we came here. We're in diaspora to, you know, express our anger, disapproval, and you know, submit a petition to you. We actually targeted to meet with the president. Well, we heard he was in London for holiday, but I think he left a few days ago. So at least once we get it to you guys, and we still get the message. And we're very angry. We were in diaspora angry with what happened and the children itself. We have submitted a petition in court. The lawyers are working. All we are pleading is to let judiciary do their work and let justice be served. So that's why we're here today. And we have the petition. So I'll just go and read it. And one of the paragraphs that we believe that the international community, including the United Kingdom, should not only condemn these actions but also monitor the ongoing judicial proceedings to ensure that justice is served. It is imperative that the Nigerian judiciary is allowed to function independently and free from political interference. Given the level of corruption we have already witnessed in other government institutions, we respectfully appeal to you for your intervention in ensuring the credibility and impartiality of the Nigerian judiciary as it examines the evidence before it. Thank you. Okay. Um, thank you for coming to express your feelings about um, whatever has happened in this day. This is before we head to the first. Send it to the appropriate authorities and make sure it gets to the president. And I'm sure your complaints will be heard and some people will be allowed. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. Three questions, sir. Yes, we need it. Yeah. We need Wait, hold on, hold on. Now, now, is it possible video, that video. with all this video we evidence so need, video. that you can say that no, you did not receive this copy? No, we need. Is it possible that need. with all this video evidence that you did this. not receive this copy? Is it possible? Because that is what we are talking about. Oh no, he's a he's a new ambassador. Congratulations, sir. He's Ambassador Mohammed. I'm not talking about me. I'm just using I'm just using it as a reference to what happened to Edo State vote. Right? The vote was casted and people had evidence of what was dropped on IREV. So I'm saying to you, is it possible that you've taken this copy and it is on life with video evidence that you did not receive this? Can you say that? Can, can, can anybody say that? I'll give them, I'll give them. Can I make a comment about what you're saying? I've received this Thank and you. it will be submitted. Thank you. We need an acknowledgement, please. We need an acknowledgement of the letter we have given. No, when you give out a letter, you receive it, you sign an acknowledgement. When I went to INEC office in Abuja, 
I gave them two, and they acknowledged and gave me one. So we need one. Let, let, let me give you another. You let me give you a copy. Don't just take the letter and put it. Our issue to the president of Nigeria, Tinubu. We are okay. trying to now. He should give us our mandate. Why is the president in, indicted in this? Why he's, is he is is the one behind this whole problem, and he costed nobody else because he gave the order to the INEC chairman and also to the IG. They are working for him, and we demand them to restore back what belong to the people. Okay. Why should they restore? The reason why they should restore because the man that we elected uh, is capable of taking us to the next level and is going to help Edo State and even help Nigeria. Can, can I want the election. Can I just ask him can I just ask him one question please? Um sorry uh I, I, let me just bring this question to my head. What happened in Edo State uh 2024 election? On the 21st yes we all went out. I went to vote. We it's voted. We left England, flew down with a lot of guys from the diaspora because one, we believe in the principal. We believe in Aswe, we believe in Oge. And we believe that these two people are men that savvy that can take Edo State to the next level. We all flew down to Nigeria, to Benin, to vote. And after voting, people were asking us, are you guys sure that our, our vote will be counted? We assured them that it will be counted. After that day, by 7 p.m., we were already celebrating because the people of Edo State came out en masse and voted for the man that they love, the man that would take the next state to the next level, to the, 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 the Edo State to the next level. And they voted en massively. Let, let Before me ask. 9, they started denying us. They started manipulating the results. And they drove out our, our governor from the collation center and started doing all sorts of things. Before morning, we noticed that the, the whole thing has changed. Let me tell you, do you know at 7 p.m., we were already leading with 63,000 votes. Let, let me ask, just go to another. I'm looking at the placards here. Has this sort of thing ever happened in a Doe state before, or you're just fighting? Uh, it has never fight? happened before, and that is the reason why we are out. We've been to Abuja, we've been to INEC office. And we are, we are going to Washington this year as well. We are going to, for because it has never happened before. And that is why we are saying it can never happen. Enough is enough. enough. And, and, and your message today, who, who are your messages directed? Is Directly to the president of Nigeria. Ashwaju Bola Ahmed Tidumbu. He should, they call him Jagaban. He should off his hand from Edo State. Edo is not Nigeria, a Lagos. He's the, the, the Jagaban of the election region. Yes. He's, 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 not, he's not Lagos. He's, 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 he's a mandate grabber. Let, let, me, let me ask another person a question. A Sir, grabber. he says Edo 2024, return Edo's people's mandate. Do you feel disenfranchised? Yes, yes, honestly, yes. We, you, not only me, the good people of Edo State, Feel the same thing, disenfranchised. Yes. You went there to you voted, or your people? Yes, 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 yes. I went to Nigeria to Edo Bini Ishan. I voted. Yes. Why do you feel you? You think even away from PDP or anything, this result, if not overturned, would destroy Edo's elections going forward? If so not overturned, not, not, not just Edo, Nigeria. not just Edo. We even have Ondo coming up soon. If it is not addressed now, Ondo will follow the same thing like Edo. Thank you. And thank we don't want that to continue. They said, they said that they want to use a template of yeah. a do state. state to for for the whole state. And let me say yes. this, let me say this, gentlemen of the press, let me say this. The intention of the president of Nigeria is to turn the whole Nigeria to a, a one-party one state. state. Hold on. It will not happen. Hold on. I see the ex-commissioner, DGG. Uh, uh, Commissioner Iroh, how are you? How are you? Good to see you guys. Good, good to good see morning. you, sir. We are here to submit a petition. To the Nigerian house, and you can see our brothers and sisters came out, made their job here today. Oh, to come out in the cold, to come and submit our petition, you know, to the embassy. We actually targeting uh, the president. We heard he was in London, and that was why we decided to come and see him. But a few days ago, he left for Nigeria. But we are here today. The amb acting ambassador will be out to receive us and get the petition letter, so that we let the world know what actually happened on the 21st of uh, September in Benin, where election was rigged by INEC the police and the APC ruling party. So we are very, very angry. You can see the no people that are here. We all came out, we voted for our party. We voted for the right person. We voted for Dr. Asre Gudalo and Osarodio. But fortunately, 
the result was overturned. The people's wish were not, you know, granted. We are very, very angry, and we just hope the whole world let the judiciary know what is going on S sorry. and let judiciary, you know, take its course so that we we'll have we have already submitted our petition in court, and we are hoping that the judiciary will do just. You know, I'll let justice itself. Sir, can I just ask one question? Uh, there's a placard behind you saying AI and O2 won the election by over 75%. Is that the case? If yes. you still go to RF, yes. Potter, Inek it's Potter the now, the results are still there. The Inek Potter. Yeah, Inek Potter. The yeah, results sure are still like there, 75%. How, does, how did the whole process work? Please explain to the people. No. Yes, when you vote at the unit level. Correct. That is with the uh, for EC8. You vote at unit level, it's collated at unit level. And it sent a red result How straight to INEC by uh, Beavers. INEC Beavers. The officials to take notice of their record, right? Of course. Yes. And they send it by WhatsApp. By no, WhatsApp. not WhatsApp. Apart from WhatsApp. Apart by WhatsApp from and what Beavers. They straight to their and they put their pictures of it. Of course. Yes. And you yeah. give the result so, yeah. to the agent. You have a timestamp. Yes. Of course. There's yes. a timestamp yes. of yes. this picture. It's sent real time. Yes. Real time. Yes. During yes. accreditation. Yes. You're talking about accreditation. Yes. When you do your accreditation before you vote at the unit level, the uh, beavers take everything and it's, you know the time bound, everything is there. You can't change it. So one you put it result at the unit level, it goes straight, you know, to our quarter, and then quarter, which is there. And if you go there now they can't change it. So as the PDP was leaving 75% as it's still there as you speak. Why would anybody say close your eyes to what is real and say this this is direction? Why? Well, that is why we are and here. That's why we are here. Sir, so, I, I, I've been hearing so I've been hearing your message is directed at Tinubu, but I'm hearing INEC. I'm seeing INEC everywhere. Is it? INEC, senior INEC officials. Tinubu said he was going to give the Edo. No, 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 listen, that's not question. Okay. Okay. The INEC the, officials collected the yeah. result at the INEC office on that day. And you can see by 2 a.m. when the director general of the campaign, right honorable Mount Yudu, he came in, was shouting and shouting and saying that they are collecting results, Ikubaoka, Oredo, and Ego results. We are being collected at INEC office by senior INEC officials. So that is when the governor of Azeki went there to see the wreck, but they locked themselves in the room. So, so, no, so, very so, wrong. Sorry, sorry, let me say, they, they said that was says INEC and Nigerian police. Where was Nigerian police when all this was happening, sir? They used the police to drive everybody away. They drove out the uh, PDP agents. They didn't allow them to enter the uh, INEC office. When we all came there, they refused. The police refused INEC uh, PDP agents to go in there. PDP and other parties. And other parties. So, so you are here today for the president, for INEC, and for the, the police, police yes. or, or and especially the judiciary. Since we have submitted our petition in court, there's going to be a tribunal process for so one or eighty days, and from there it goes to the appeal court and the supreme court. So we want the judiciary to do the needful, so that justice will be served, and let the real winner of that election, you know, be declared. So this protest is more putting pressure on the judiciary. We are here to submit a petition. Yeah. You know, and we just here, yeah, that's why you have your first here today, submit a petition to the Nigerian okay. Because okay. it was actually so, targeted at the president. The the president the very simple. Thank you. Simple. Sorry, sir. Can thank, you thank, yes, yes, yes. Go, go, sorry, sorry. I, I want to go to everybody now. You, you, you asked the question of the judiciary? Yes. Remember, the present Chief Justice of the Federation, she was the one that presided over Imo State election. Everybody knew what happened, what transpired. Now that she's in the last position, after this is retirement. So she has the opportunity to redeem her image. All the mess she created during the state election tribunal or to the Supreme Court, where she presided, it is time for her to redeem her image. Because by the time she leaves this office, she's going into retirement. No more position for her. Okay. So every Nigerians are calling on her. Thank you. Let, let me come to somebody else. Sir, you put INEC and Nigerian police and collided to change the result. How much truth is in that statement? But before the election takes place, the IG of police, first and foremost, disbanded the Edo State Vigilante to create room so they can do their job. The surely job they did. It's very clear. The, one of the greatest mistakes they made was that what? 98% of the election have been uploaded to IRF and 98 percent and just about two percent left you cannot say at about 98 percent 98 percent 75 percent already the PDP were winning the election how come two percent mathematically two plus two is four how can you come back again from the end to say that about two percent 
override net, net You percent. say it's not possible. It's not it's possible. Not po Sir, uh, you say uh, return Edo people's mandate. You are very sure this the, the mandate absolutely, is in the wrong hands? Absolutely, absolutely. Let me add to what you just said. I was personally attacked at Oluwa Primary School. Oshimale policemen, non real policemen came to our center. I was attacked. They arrested, unlawfully arrested one of, of my members, took his bag, they never returned till date. The police came to intimidate us, forced uh, the result out of the INEC officials before they were moved down from Egosa Grammar School down to so you witness you witness oh, the yes, whole thing. Yes, I was okay. There's, 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 a woman, yeah. there's a woman behind you. Let me talk to her. Auntie, how are you? I'm fine. Auntie, you say AI 021 by over 75%. Your people told you or you were there? I was there. You was there? Yeah. What happened? I, I, I don't know because uh, before then, my. Um, I, I guess. Be yes, before then. So the, the uh, APC, they were telling me that uh, APC members. My, some of my friends, they were saying they are going to ring it from above. Because I said, because everywhere was uh, PDP, PDP, PDP. They were just saying, you, are, you guys are just wasting your time. Because they are going to read it, uh, ring it from the above. So I was laughing. I said, ah, it's not going to be possible. It's not going to be possible. Mm -hmm. He said, just watch and see. Oh my God, I'm so, so sorry. I'm yeah. so sorry. So, sir, you say a no democracy is at stake. You of mean course. bigger than PDP or everything? Yeah, of course. Have because you seen this before? This is the first time. This is the first time in my life. Because how do you stop uploading any results at 98.83%? You have the IRF results, yeah. Here. This is not PDP site. This is INEC official site. So, yes. if it's still here till now, what's the argument about? What time did you catch that result? This is still, still dead. Yeah. It's still there. That yeah, was the live, live result. Now. It's yeah. live. It's still okay. there right now. Okay. It's still there. So, so that's I, why we're asking the judiciary to do the right thing. Right 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 I'm not. Right. It's different from what is on the area. It's not 1999 where you just write it. There's another one. What I just what I meant is the truth. The job of the judiciary is very simple. A gentleman said just now about the lady, Chief Judge of Nigeria. The job is very easy. No job, nothing. Collect all the results on IRA Potter according to the INEX rules. Let, and that's the result. Let, if the if the APC win, clearly we will accept the result. But if otherwise, the result will be received. Thank you. Let, Thank let you. Me say let, me, let me let ask, me ask. I, I see a man let talking. Let Wait, let me just ask another man. So where are you? Where is your anger? Is it INEC? Is it Tinubu? Is it the police? Where is your anger? My oh. anger is going to go to the INEC and the judiciary to please do the right thing to make sure our votes count in Ledo. Thank you. Thank you very much. Hi, it's Adol Connect, and we're right outside the Nigerian Embassy in London. And this is a group of concerned Adolites about the Adol 2024 results. I've been talking to them. They've had all messages on the placards that the election has been stolen. The petition has been submitted to the embassy, uh, directed at INEC, directed at the president, directed at the police. And uh, people are scared for democracy in Adol State. This is good because it brings awareness to uh, future elections and I hope the judiciary can uh, cover themselves in, in gold at the end of this process. Thank you very much. It's been a, an enjoyable day, Wednesday in London, and people took their time out. Very nice. Thank you. Here with this lovely lady, she come to hold the camera. We're right outside Nigeria Embassy. Peace. Go where? Peace. Peace. <laughs>